Today, I have the pleasure of speaking with Tom Meredith from West Red Lake Gold. How are you today, Tom? Good, thanks, Tracy. How are you? Tom, we are so excited to get an exploration update. But first, let's talk about the gold market because it's directly correlated to all of us as shareholders at West Red Lake Gold. What's happening with the gold market? Well, the gold market is uh, seems to be setting up nicely for a, a pretty strong run starting later this year, likely when the when the Fed takes its foot off the brakes, and we'll have a situation where we have underlying inflation, but in, the interest rate tightening cycle will be over, and that should most likely cause capital flows in, into our into the gold market in our sector. So we think that'll be the signal, and if you look at technically measuring the gold market, um, many of the people that I read up on and speak to see that once gold gets through $2,100 an ounce, it could go all the way to $3,000 an ounce. Uh, so it looks very promising uh, later this year and into next year. So Tom, we're very interested in an update on West Red Lake Gold. How about we start about uh, your exploration a diamond drilling uh, a news release that you just put out recently? Thank you. Yes, our, our news release really is setting out what we're going to be doing for the balance of the year. We're going to start with a, a drill program at the north end of the NT zone, where we've been drilling for about the last two or three years, uh, out, trying to outline a new resource area, which is uh, separate from the, the uh, Rowan deposit, which is a, a few hundred meters away. We have a million ounces of gold at the Rowan deposit. Um, and then the also, we'll be doing some more surface work at Rowan, trying to outline uh, high-grade zones at surface that would be something that could be potentially mined at surface. And what's good about uh, future surface mining is it's, it's very inexpensive to do surface mining. It's very profitable. So it makes it easy, much, much better to get a mine started with high-grade surface ore at Rowan. So that makes the property more attractive as a as a starting area to, for future mining. And the timeline for these results would be middle of the year, late summer, what are we looking at? Well, uh, based on how slow the labs are, I would say uh, definitely late summer or later. Well, speaking of uh, the gold market in general, will you be attending PDAC 2022? Yes, we have a, we have a booth at PDAC uh, this year. And so we'll be there. Okay, fantastic. So in addition to that, um, I think the last piece of news that West Red Lake put out was about your financing. How did your financing go and is there any update on that? Well, we, we, we've got financing in place to start the drill program that we have in mind. Uh, the first drill pr program we're gonna do this year, which is to expand the NT zone at the north end in an area which we call Porphyry Hill. And uh, that'll be the first drilling that's been done there for many, many years. And the first drilling we've done, and we see that as an area to increase the mineralization on the property. And then later on, we plan to do some drilling at the end of the year as well, probably at Rowan, but that remains to be seen. Well, I think that's what I was gonna ask you next, which is, is there anything else that you'd like to add that we should be looking forward to in the next quarter or two? In the next quarter or two, just, just that we get started uh, drilling at the NT zone, the Porphyry Hill area of the NT zone. And then followed by that would be uh, some, some surface sampling at the Rowan deposit. Well, Tom, as always, it's a real pleasure getting an update on West Red Lake Gold. And to get more information, go here to their website. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tracy.